about to watch the Soros trailer. Grand Blue came out. Uh, the cast, you know, I don't really like the cast right now. You know, Percival's cool. He's like the only character I think is really cool right now. But Soros, this is this is who I wanted, right? This is one of the guys. I was like, I want him in the game. I had no idea they were gonna put him in. When they actually announced him for the first the first DLC, I was like, what the fuck? Like, really? I thought it'd take like three seasons for any cool character to come out, but we got it. Trailer, first time. Do not expect any Maximilian to reaction. I'm just a normal guy, but let's see. It's sick. Come on, man. Uh oh. I don't like that ending, though. Dude, that shit was godlike. Let's talk about this. All right, that shit was sick. That shit was sick. One, because like the animation in this game is already really good, right? The animation is already really good, but like this one's even better, right? Is it just me? I feel like his animation is like one step above the rest. Looking at his moves though, that move looked good, except there was a wind up before that. So what I'm thinking about is for me, I picked Percival. You know, he was my first character and I quit him for one reason, and that was Ferry. So that was my that was my worry about Suri. You know, he's a close range, like in fighter, like can he get in on Ferry? Can he beat Ferry? Damn that shit is sick. He's got the custom ending too. Damn, he's godlike. This ending though. This is where where Jita comes in here. Yeah, I don't know about that one. Alright, comes in here. La Diva does the Lariat. So Larry is a high if you don't play this game, if you don't know, right? So Larry is a high. He ducks. Stand. Like, is what is that? It doesn't look like a close range move, right? Is that his auto combo? It's just the trailer moving and this probably just his light. If that's the case though, that doesn't look too good to me. Close H. I don't know about that. You think it's close H? That'd be kind of sad to have an H like that. The way this jump normal looks too, that might be jump. I was going to say that might be jump D, but I don't know. Damn, he's sick. Da -da, counter hit, of course. It was a different auto combo there. So this is, I don't know, about M or something. Shit, I don't know. Then that's a Larry. So that looks really good, except there's that weird charge up before, right? Osriel has got Gustav Buster. No, 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 you can't call it the thing. You can't call it Gustav Buster. Gustav Buster and Pile Bunker, they go. They just go. That's why they're so stupid, right? It just, boom. All right, you got hit. This little charge, I don't know about that. Now, that move right there, is this a DP? Le and this is level one. That shit looks sick. That was his level one, right? He, he probably got three, but hey, level one, look. I'm not complaining. Let me say it again. I'm kind of complaining. Except it's Sora, so it's okay. But level 1 supers having the cut-in animation. You guys, I know you guys don't play fighting games. I know everyone watching just a casual. But uh, a warrior such as myself who plays hundreds and hundreds and thousands of games. You get really tired of seeing this shit. Like Katarina's level 1. Lancelot's level 1 too. It's like, please, I'm, I don't want to see this anymore. Please. Level three, fine. Okay, level three is like, oh, you got me. Bop, bop. But that doesn't look. If it's like that, if that's what it is, then that's fine. If he does like a pose, because that's that's like a Dragon Ball level one, you know. That's like a Dragon Ball level one where you do like the intro movie and then the move just happens. Bah, bop, bop. Like if that's it, I'll be like, that's godlike. Throw. That's a taunt. Air grab. RPG mode. 
Now, what's that? So, counter... Is that a counter super? Is that install mode? Is that what it is? He installs... Or is it not? I don't know. I don't know if that counter is, like, his DP. I don't want a counter, man. I don't want a counter. Unless it's Leo, one button, behind the back, block everything counter. I like this meme, though. So, this is a good meme. If you notice, they did it for Narmaya. This is why I'm telling you guys, you know... People don't believe me. They do not believe me when I said that Gran and Cat were intentionally overpowered by design. If you don't believe me, how come every trailer has Gran's boot? Because they know that move is broken. Look. Every trailer, the boot. They know the boot is fucking busted. That's why they put it in there as a joke. They had uh, Narmaya beat the boot. They had Jita uh, clash with the boot. The goddamn boot. So then he installs. That might be the super. We don't know. But now, yes. Fundoshi's out. That run? That's probably not normal run, right? My man just charged at full screen. Da -da 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 -da. Kicking Percival in the face. He's got new moves. Yeah, it looks like he got all new moves now. Yes. What the hell does it say? Fist army. I don't know. I'm going to read this. Weird stuff. Boom. Black and white. That looks like Street Fighter. You think they're, you think they're trolling Street Fighter? It's like the, the ink finish. I like how this art... I like his added to the, the portrait, too. Dude, one day, this game is going to have... I guess it's not... I Don't get me wrong. I, I don't want to sound like people are already angry that there's so few casts. But, I mean, this game's going to keep going, hopefully. You know, it sold really well. It's so popular. Hopefully, like, one day, there's, like, 30, 40 characters. And, yes, that is a Ziz pose. Rip, rip in peace to the legend. All right, give me, uh, give me the move list again. Super Skybound Art. Macho Ultimatum. Sora strips down as Fendoshi the rest of the round. One effect he gains. Increased defense based on damage he took during Muzzle Fury. What's that? Buffed abilities. Special follow-ups his abilities. Ability 1. Impact Knuckle. His rush attack. The L version travels a short distance while the MMH version goes further. While under Macho Ultimatum, it travels. So he gets buffed Lariat when he's in the super mode. Uh-huh. An upwards kick. Useful against airborne opponents. Does not have any invul. We'll see. I don't know about that move number two, though. An upwards kick with no invul? The the flex, the parry looking move is his uh, unique ability. It beats all attacks other than throws, skybound arts, and super skybound arts. He buffs up, gains meter. Oh, that's cool. That's cool. I like that. So he, he gets buffed up. He gains meter so he can go into his whatever earlier. So I didn't see anything that said he had a DP. Which means I'm probably not going to play his character. I'm sorry. Look, I'm telling you, as manly as he is, the manliest thing in any fighting game is a DP. I might be a Gita main then. Yeah. <laughs> if my man doesn't have a, a reversal of any sort, I might be done. I mean, he might be dead on day one. This might be my, my drunken casual character. My man was supposed to be... He's supposed to be the gorilla of gorillas. He was supposed to be the king of the jungle. You can't be the king of the jungle without a DP. We'll see. There's always hope.